Hi, my name is Simone Larcher, and I'm a lecturer in environmental engineering in the civil and natural resources engineering departments. I was motivated to become an environmental engineer because it enables me to protect the environment as well as human and animal health using engineering design and applied science. What I find exciting about environmental engineering is its collaborative, multidisciplinary, and interdisciplinary nature. For instance, my research uses methods and skills and knowledge from civil and natural resources engineering, but also draws on expertise from chemistry, chemical engineering, toxicology, applied microbiology, and biotechnology. Specifically, my research aims to harness the abilities of naturally occurring microorganisms in our environment to, de to degrade persistent and harmful emerging contaminants and endocrine disrupting compounds. These contaminants are present in our environment at trace concentrations due to our everyday life, our use of plastics, stain repellent and water resistant materials, cleaning agents, disinfectants, personal, personal care products and cosmetics, as well as pharmaceuticals such as antibiotics and other prescription and over-the-counter drugs. If you come to study civil and natural resources engineering, you will take a course in environmental engineering in your first professional year of studies. You will learn about water quality and chemistry, ecosystems, drinking water treatment, wastewater treatment, and solid and hazardous waste management. If you decide to focus on natural resources engineering, you will also take a course in ecological engineering in which I teach a module on biogeochemistry, applied microbiology, as well as soil and groundwater remediation. If you have any questions about environmental engineering or about the research and courses I just described, please get in touch.